Yo, fasting and retention on your spiritual journey creates you superpowers, bro. Like prophets, Elijah, Moses, Jesus, right? So Elijah, right, went 40 days, 40 nights, <laughs> not eating, not drinking. Well, I don't know if it was a dry fast. He might have had water, but he walked for 40 days. Elijah till he got to till he got where he needed to go because he was fasting because basically his life was in danger. So he needed God's protection at an all time high because Jezebel was trying to destroy him, kill him because she was already killing all the prophets. So Elijah basically had to fast for 40 days. And at the end of his fast, he received breakthrough. You know what I'm saying? And Jezebel was defeated. I'm sure you all know the story, right? She got eaten eaten by dogs her own people threw her out the window and dogs ate her hellhounds basically zombies if you play call of duty bro the hellhounds fetch me their soul <laughs> yo, yo jezebel's soul got fetched right so basically yeah that's what happened with her and then moses right moses moses fasted 40 days 40 nights at least three times you know what i'm saying but moses was just that was his lifestyle. He he just fasted all the time. You know what I'm saying? That's all he did was fast. Because Moses was really like, God, he was always talking to God, bro. Always speaking with God, bro. Face to face with God. You know what I mean? Moses split the Red Sea, bro. Moses wrote the Ten Commandments. Moses, Moses led the people out of Egypt, man. That's, that's, that's superpowers, bro. You led 500,000 slaves out of Egypt and you split the Red Sea and you write the Ten Commandments. Oh, you got superpowers, bro. Sorry to break it to you, but that's superpowers, bro. And then the Messiah, right? Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Yahshua, Hamashiach, or whatever you want to call him, right? So basically, he went 40 days, 40 nights, water fast. You know what I mean? That's the that's the that's the Messiah fast, bro. 40 days, 40 nights water. And honestly, we can do that. We can do 40 nights, 40 days, 40 nights just water. Just like him. Or liquid, you know what I mean? Tea, coffee, water, whatever, bro. As long as you're not eating solid food, bro, it's still you're still fasting, right? I I would start with like 2 3 days, bro. 2 3 days, 3 days is good. You know what I mean? You'll see breakthrough after three days. You know what I mean? You do four days, bro. Like Ahab did a four-day dry fast. You know what I'm saying? Paul, Paul did like Paul did a four-day dry fast. You know, I think it was four. You know what I'm saying? So basically, bro, all this gets you closer to God. All this gives you superpowers and it breaks you free from the sins that you've committed. So basically, bro, you're gonna be brand new. You're gonna be refilled as if the sin never happened because of a fast. Or if you need some financial breakthrough in your life, bro, pray to God for some financial help or pray to God for some knowledge. You know what I'm saying? If you want a wife or something, you want a spouse, whatever they call it, pray for that. And then maybe he'll show you in your dreams who it is. You know what I'm saying? Or maybe she'll just show up in your life. Who knows? You know what I'm saying? But it's all part of God's timing. So it might not happen overnight. It might take a week, might take a month, might take a year. But pray for what you need. Pray for what you want. Pray that his will be done in your life because that's what's going to make the prayer even more powerful is if it's God's will. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, bro. But none of us is perfect. That's why we all need a fast. And actually, Jesus calls us to fast. God calls us to fast. The Holy Spirit calls us to fast. So maybe you got to fast. You know what I'm saying? If it's a day, if it's two days, you know what I'm saying? I would say fast at least one day a week to really receive breakthrough, really receive blessings in your life. You know what I'm saying? You should be happy. You should be joyful that you fast and you're doing something for God, bro. You're doing something for the Lord. You know what I mean? That's what should really make you happy. That's what should really make you glad you know what i'm saying but yeah bro you're gonna be superpowers bro like literally you do it bro you do a seven day fast bro you a king
You a king. You do a seven day fast. Use a king. Use a queen. You know what I'm saying? So like, comment, subscribe to the channel.